Pakistan is not great on taking good advice. If you have snakes in your backyard, you can't expect them to bite only your neighbors. Yesterday, we heard the Pakistani Foreign Minister Bhutto uh, mention Kashmir in the UN Security Council meeting on reformed multilateralism. Uh, another Pakistani minister, Hinarabani Khar, is talking about a dossier and allegations against India uh, coming from a country that hosted Osama bin Laden. Um, uh, your thoughts uh, on this? And also a quick question on the latest clashes between the Indian and the Chinese uh, forces. In Arunachal, if you can comment on that. Thank you. Well, uh uh, I saw, I, I read the reports on what uh, uh, Minister Hina Rabani Khar uh, said. And, uh, you know, I was reminded uh, uh, more than a decade ago, uh, if my memory serves me right, Hillary Clinton was visiting uh, Islam, uh, Pakistan, Islamabad. And uh, Hina Rabani Khar was a minister at that time. And I think standing next to her, Hillary Clinton actually said that if you have, I'm, I'm giving you the sense, it's not an exact quote, that if you have snakes in your backyard, you can't expect them to bite only your neighbors. Eventually, they will bite the people who keep them in the backyard. Uh, but as you know, Pakistan is not great on taking good advice, uh, and you see uh, what's happening there. In terms of what they are saying, look, uh, the, the truth is, everybody, uh, the world today sees them as the epicenter of, of terrorism. Now, uh, I know we've been through uh, two and a half years of COVID, uh, and a lot of us have brain fog as a result. Uh, but I assure you, the world has not forgotten, you know, where, is, where does terrorism, you know, who has their fingerprints over a lot of uh, activities, in the region and beyond the region. So, so I would say that uh, uh, it's something which, which uh, uh, they should remind themselves before, before you know, indulging in the kind of fantasies uh, which uh, they do.